And this is radio. Okay. Hi, Ryan. It's Renee. How are you? Renee, it's been a long time. How are you doing? Very good. Very good. All right. Excellent. I have about uh, 15 seconds and we'll be live. Okay, great. Monday, an experienced live music. Visit Giamia today at 13 North 3rd Street in Geneva and online at giamiapizzabar.com. Back on the Big Wake Up Call, AM 1280 WBIG. I'm Ryan Gatenby, and uh, we always have a good time talking to my next guest. She is toy and games reporter for DailyLounge.com, and uh, going to give us some Black Friday toy shopping ideas. Going to visit with Renee Rice. Good morning. Good morning, Ryan. It's great to be a part of your show. Yeah, Renee, it has been too long. How have you been? Hey, I've been out playing. I play all year round, <laughs> so I can bring you some of the best stuff. <laughs> all right, I'm looking forward to this, and uh, I have a, uh, you know, I have uh, two older sons. I have a 19-year-old and a 16-year-old, but I have a three-year-old daughter who is ready to get some toys. So, what do you have for us? Well, we know that kids love to build, and I have a Lego Duplo steam train, and it uses bricks designed for a child's smaller hands. So it invites kids as young as two, so your three-year-old would love this. Yeah, it invites them to tinker with their ability to code, and that, of course, teaches cause and effect learning. So the train has a color sensor, and the children can place colored action bricks along the track, and it'll do things like sound the horn, activate the lights, change the direction of the train wherever they want to go. And so the young children actually become the conductor. There's a push and go motor and just a little gentle push either forwards or backwards sends the train on its way. I think that's great. It gives the kids a little sense of uh, ownership because uh, she's just three, but you know, kids just become more and more independent. They want to do so much more for themselves. So this seems like that's, that's a great idea for doing that. Yes, it is. And it comes with the little people figures, the conductor and a little girl and a, even a little squirrel. So they'll love that. <laughs> even a squirrel, oh, that's fantastic. Um, what about uh, what about for the older kids? Anything uh, new and exciting? Well, actually, your older boys will probably like this. This is a video game, and they're always a popular choice. And so Activision just released their Spyro Reignited Trilogy, and it celebrates the 20th anniversary of Spyro. Oh, sure, it's, yeah. It's remastered in HD, and it lets the players rediscover that adventure that they found in the classic game, but there's a modern-day feel to it. And it's rated E10+, plus, so perfect for your boys, three games in one. So you can actually explore over 100 levels of Spyro games that you might remember playing. There's the fiery personalities, the incredible environments, and that iconic open world gameplay. That's, I haven't thought about uh, Spyro in a long time, but oh my gosh, that's you know, dating myself, going back to the old uh, PlayStation 1, like late 90s, right? Yes, it was actually 1998, I think wow. it was. Uh, no, 19, yeah, 98, because it's the 20th anniversary. Oh, man. Well, that'll be, that'll be kind of introducing that to a whole new generation. I like that. Yes, yeah, so you can play with your kids. <laughs> oh, having experience. I'm, there's a game I might actually be able to beat them at. That would be cool. <laughs> <laughs> um, what else do you have? Well, remember Hatchimals from last year? Well, oh, yeah. they were so popular last year, they're back, but there's new versions. So this year, you can hatch the adorable Hatcha Babies. There's a fox fin version. It's only available at Walmart, but it comes with four surprise accessories plus a bonus rocking horse. And so kids can learn to feed and burp and cuddle and take care of them just like real babies. Are there now? Are they uh, have they increased production? Because I remember uh, last year that uh, there people were, were were fighting to get some of these hatchimals. Yes, they actually had a whole year to build up production for this. And besides the hatch of babies that are at Walmart, there's n other ones that are called hatchimal surprise, and these are only at Target. But these let you hatch twins. So each twin has a unique personality. One of them loves to move. The other one can repeat whatever you say. <laughs> And with these, you can raise them from a baby to a toddler to a kid, and they'll interact, they'll learn new things at every stage. So this is another one that might, you know, be fun for your little one. Yeah, what's the recommended age range for the Hatchimals, do you know? It's five plus, but if okay. you um, play with it with your child and show her how to cuddle it and pat it and tap it and hug it and hatch it, then, you know, she'll love to teach it, you know, how to say I love you and different things like that. Well, that's so cute because her thing lately is taking all of her stuffed animals, and I, I think I, hopefully she's going to be a caring nurturer because she puts them all to bed every night and gives them a little pillow and a blanket. I think it's. I know oh, everyone that's talks about perfect. their kids and it's boring, she, but that's adorable. Does she also like to pretend that she's cooking? Does she do that? 
She does. She has her own little uh, toy kitchen in, uh, in our kitchen. Well, I've got this new product, and this is one of those that amazes me that somebody didn't think of it before. It's lightweight fabric. It's called the Popover Stove Set, and you place it on top of a chair. So it's by Kangaroo Manufacturing. There's an easy on, easy off design. You just put it right on top of a chair and then it sits flat and it promotes, you know, kitchen role play for kids. You can add accessories like play food and pots and pans. And then when they're done playing, this award-winning sturdy canvas play set folds flat for storage. So you can put it away. It's a big benefit for families and for grandparents. So it's both affordable and teaches kids life skills. It's great. That, uh, so it's just like it kind of uh, becomes a kitchen play set? Yes, it becomes a kitchen stove set. So you've got, um, it's like the, you know, the, the back of it is like the back of the stove, and they've got like a little blender on there. There's oh, a cute. little toaster, um, lots of little things that you can pretend that you're opening and closing. And then a lot of people, you probably have some pots and pans at home, or you can buy some of the sets that also come by Kangaroo Manufacturing with kitchen sets and pretend food sets. They even have like a little chef's uniform that they can wear. See, that seems nice for people maybe with, uh, you know, a smaller uh, city apartment because, you know, I, I believe ours is about 97% uh, toys at this point. <laughs> well, this is an alternative to those big play sets, you know, for the kitchen sets yeah. that stay in your kitchen or stay in your playroom year round. I like that. Um, Renee, do you have anything else you want to share? Um, I'd say if you go to dailylounge.com, they can learn your, you know, your listeners can learn more about all of these toys and even more. And, you know, just find something that your kid loves to do as a hobby. And if you can find a, you know, a toy product that matches that passion, they're going to keep coming back to it over and over again. Now, are these available now or is this, I'm waiting for Black Friday to get these? Every single, well, all of them are available except for the um, Hatchy Baby's Fox Fin that's at Walmart and the Hatchimal Surprise at Target. They're available now. They came out on October 6th. So they were hatched then, you know, they were, you know, the babies are available. So, and in fact, with Toys R Us not around this year, people will oh, yeah. probably want to go out and get all of the toys that they want early because they can't rely on going into a Toys R Us store at the last minute and picking it up. So if you see it, Go get it now. There's Some people have already started their um, Black Friday sales. And that's uh, Toy and Games reporter for DailyLounge.com, Renee Rice. Renee, it is always fun talking toys with you. Let's, uh, let's talk sooner than later. Okay, that sounds like a plan. Thank you. Okay, thank you. And uh, we are back to uh, wrap up on the big wake-up call next. Sip Parties is a 